Welcome back to A Moment in History. I'm Seth Udinsky. One of the most beloved staples of the Christmas tradition is lights. We light up our Christmas trees, we light up our roofs, we light up our hearths, we light up our bushes, and sometimes we even light up our cars. I've never done that, but maybe you have. This begs the question, why do we put up lights at Christmas time? Where did this beloved tradition come from and who started it? As is usually the case with these things, the answer may be far older than you might think. Well, many critics believe that the tradition of lights at Christmas finds its roots in ancient pagan rituals, particularly in pre-Christian Northern Europe. Now, since the ancient pagan celebrations at the end of the year took place in the Northern Hemisphere when light was lacking during the winter months, some historians believe that pagans focused on light in their celebrations, and then the Christians overtook these traditions some 1,500 years ago, and we've been doing it that way ever since. That's not really how it happened. The tradition of light at Christmas time finds its roots in the person of Jesus Christ himself. First and foremost, Jesus described himself during his earthly ministry as the light of the world. He was also prophesied in Isaiah 9 as being the light that shines for a people who have walked in darkness. And furthermore, the Apostle John describes the Lord as the light that shines in the darkness, the light and life of men during his prologue of his gospel account. Additionally, let us not forget also the account of Christ's birth himself. On that first Christmas morning, in the moments after he was born, a host of angels lit up the night sky over Bethlehem to announce the glorious coming of the Lord to the shepherds in their fields nearby. And then, of course, sometime later, when the wise men were searching for the Christ child in the Middle Eastern desert, a God-ordained bright star appeared in the sky and guided them to the place where Jesus was. Light is indeed a staple of Christmas and has been since the earliest Christmas celebrations during the Roman Empire. So these traditions continued through the Middle Ages, but it was the actions actually of a very famous theologian which began one of our most beloved traditions History tells us that the German reformer Martin Luther, the exact same Luther who launched the Protestant Reformation in 1517, began the beloved tradition of lighting up Christmas trees to celebrate Christ's birth. Now in Luther's day, the only way to light up a Christmas tree was with candles, and of course this lasted until the end of the 19th century. You can imagine, as I have often, the fire hazard of hundreds of candles on an evergreen tree indoors. So in the beginning of the 20th century, uh, with the recent invention of electric bulbs by the famed patenter Thomas Edison, electric lights began to be a Christmas staple on trees and on houses alike. To this day, we light up our homes and our Christmas trees as a reminder of the light of the world, Jesus Christ, who comes to bring light and life to men. Thanks so much for joining me once again for A Moment in History.